Here we go again. It's time for another directed drawing. Today we are drawing a sea turtle, which is really fun. Sea turtles are such beautiful um, ocean creatures, and so I'm excited to draw them with you today. These are the instructions we'll be following, and I will post them to our classroom like normal. If you're drawing with me today, you're going to need something to draw on, something to draw with, pencils, crayons, markers, whatever you have, we can make it work. Make sure you have your piece of paper underneath if you need it so that we don't get anything on our table or surface we're working on. All right, let's get started. I'm gonna take my marker. And the first thing I'm gonna do is draw the body of my turtle. So I'm gonna make a bigger circle in the middle, but I need to leave space on both sides for his head and his fin. So, making a nice big circle here. And then that's his body. Now I'm going to do another half kind of circle oval, sticking out for his head. I will draw his eye and a half smile. <laughs> Look at that. Now to do the inside of his shell, we are going to um, draw another circle, kind of leaving a little border here. I'm going to draw another circle inside, leaving a little bit of space. And then now I'm going to do kind of like a little swoop loop around this whole thing. Down and loop. Down, loop, up. And then I'm going to draw two big circles in the center. And with my marker, I'm just going to add just gently a couple dots here. You can do your swoops bigger or smaller. You can make smaller circles, however you want to do it. We're just designing our turtle shell. Well, now our turtle's going to need some fins. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to start here in the front. I'm going to kind of curve up and then stop and then curve it back down. Then same thing down here, curve toward me, and then curve it back in. And then he also has two fins on the back, so I'm gonna go shorter ones down and back. They're a little bit smaller, down and back. And then one pointy on the end, okay? And your fins don't have to look like mine. Mine are all a little bit different shape and size. It's okay, we're just trying our best. Remember, you can always pause it if you need more time. So now I have the outline of my turtle, and so now it's time for me to, to design my background. And so I think I'm gonna have my sea turtle be underwater, be swimming in the water. So on the top here, I'm going to draw the ocean wave so that we know that everything under the ocean is underwater, or under the waves are underwater. So I'm just gonna start here at the top and just do a little up, down, just a nice, little loopy pattern to show the ocean, okay? Now, let's see, I get to think of what I wanna put underneath. I know at the bottom of the ocean there's some sand, so I'm just gonna do a little curvy line there to show, and a few dots to show my sand. Gentle with my marker, not using the tip, kinda of using the side of my pencil or my crayon, however I'm doing it. Just a few dots to show their sand. I also want to add some seaweed, I think, here. I like the green seaweed. Someone mentioned adding a starfish, which I thought was a cool idea. So I'm just gonna add a starfish kind of sticking out of the sand there. You can have some dots on him too. Maybe I'll do a few more little seaweeds. You can draw some bubbles, like the fish is breathing. You could draw some fish swimming. Maybe they're kind of swimming away. You can draw whatever you want to add to your scenery. So, maybe I'll draw one more guy swimming the opposite way for fun. Okay. Now I am going to go ahead and start coloring here. I keep adding more. I keep thinking of what else I want to draw. So you can add as much as you want. And then now it's time for us to get started coloring. 
So get out your crayons or markers, whatever you're using. I'm gonna make my turtle green. So I'm gonna take my darker green color and I'm just gonna trace along the black lines and then I'm gonna take my lighter green color. Oh, I'm gonna fill it in, but first I forgot one more thing. I'm gonna add a couple more dots to my fins just to add some more detail. You can leave them blank or you can add your dots too. Okay, now I'm going to color in the inside of the fins with the lighter green. I'm gonna do the same thing for his head and the outer shell. For the inner part of my turtle, I'm going to do green circles, and I think I'm going to do this purple. It's actually rolling right to me. I think I'm going to do the purple for the rest of it. so far. So now we get to create the rest of our underwater scenery. You can do it however you want. Blue for the ocean, dark blue, light blue, green seaweed, however you want. So let's get coloring. Our sea turtle drawing is complete. I hope you enjoyed. I cannot wait to see your sea turtles. Don't forget to show me on our directed drawing flip grid.